All right. Let's do the vlog, Des. Saturday morning. Morning. <laughs> Voice is wrecked already. <laughs> yes, yeah, Friday. Yesterday was. It was busy, wasn't it? It was busy. It was busy. It's busy today, Des. I mean, it's going to be packed today. Yeah. <laughs> you wouldn't know it with the vlogs that he puts out. <laughs> We don't want to go in for it. Oh. I'm just knocked a bowl of water everywhere. <laughs> I think that was for the dogs. Oops. I've just kicked your bowl of water. <laughs> what are you like? The how, poor dogs, Dad. How, how mental is it? It's mental. It's brilliant, though. I was just it? saying that my voice is gone. My voice is sharp. <laughs> we're only halfway through today. I mean, we were up. Till last night, until about one o'clock. Drink, uh, Speak to have, yourself. Yeah, <laughs> you about was, midnight, I think. It was midnight. About midnight. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And then I was up at seven o'clock this morning flying the drone. What time was you up? No, similar. I'd been yeah. showered by then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Then we... Bit of a fuzzy head this morning, though. I don't know why. And then uh, Steve's got the Kadak out here. Um, just here. So I come over this morning and Steve's cooking bacon and I was like, oh, wait right there. <laughs> I went, ran and grabbed a pack of bacon and then Steve cooked all the bacon up, had a bacon roll. Um, and then basically had a shower and then just cracked on with uh, seeing people, which it's been mad, but it's so fun to see people. But seriously, the one thing that I think everyone can, can agree on and say that has come out of covid is is knowing that what you want to do you should just do because you know things can get taken away from you just like that so just if there is something you want to do you want to go see something you want to go do something you want to go explore somewhere just do it don't wait just do it because time is precious and freedoms are fragile and yeah it's so fun to be back out though so fun to be seeing people and meeting meeting everyone and Good food and everything. Love it. Someone gave, someone brought me some pork belly and some chicken wings. <laughs> it's brilliant. So, got some dirty fries. <laughs> So, <laughs> went to this place called Chef Steph. You probably can't hear me over this piano or whatever's going on. And I asked what I could have on my dirty fries and she listed it all off and I just said all of it. <laughs> so this is it. Oh, it's like Michael Scott's bagel. Oh. Look at that. So there's pulled pork on there, there's crispy chicken, there's... I mean, there's something, I, something, it's just loads of stuff on there. But yeah, and some bread, some flatbread stuff. Just having a walk around in the evening because this is the first time I've had a chance to get over it. My voice sounds like, <laughs> like I've not hit puberty yet. And uh, there's so much over here. I mean, I haven't had a look around at all yet, but it is packed with stuff, absolutely packed. There's hot air balloons in the sky. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see them. But they've been taking off uh, this morning and this evening. Um, and I've got someone trolling me now. <laughs> <laughs> There's so much going on though, isn't there? Yeah, so much. A bit too much, actually. Yeah, it's like... A bit too much for two oh, days. Oh, Dazza! Dazza! Dunkin' Donuts! Dazza! <laughs> yeah. So the two videos that have been standing... Three videos that have been standing now is Cheese Night Live, my Dunkin' Donuts video, and my romantic bath scene. They are loving the romantic bath scene. So I think they want to see me more of this in bubbles. <laughs> so 
when when nightclubs reopen and it's a bubble night, hey, I might come down. <laughs> yeah, I could combine it all. Pub donuts, then cheese or cheese, then donuts in a bubble bath. You lot, are, oh, I treat you lot so well. When it makes you fat, you'll get more bubbles. Oh god! Oh look at that! Yeah, it's pretty cool. Isn't it? It's big. That's what she said. It's a Sunday morning. He's piddling down with rain this morning. As you can see, there's the Redfords. It's a bit wet. It's a bit wet. There's. John Mandy. <laughs> maybe, he's, maybe he's left his table out. <laughs> it's getting wet. But yeah, it's a bit wet out there at the moment. There's John and Tash. It's, uh, yeah, we're all parked up in this uh, little area near the grandstand, which is, which has been good because yesterday we were so swamped. It's like people said, oh, how comes you down here and all this and that. And, um, one is easy to keep us all together, so people want to come see YouTubers, they can see us all here. Two, the amount of people that come and see us, which I'm so grateful for, and I don't expect, but I know it can happen. Um, the amount of people that we had here yesterday coming to see us, um, you know, doing sticker swaps and talking about the videos and um, talking about gadgets and tech and all this and that, which was amazing. If I was parked next to you in the field, and then, or me and uh, John and Mandy and all uh, Life Beyond Bricks and uh, the Radfords were all parked next to you in the field, and then people were just swarmed around <laughs> your van all day, <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't, you probably wouldn't like it uh, so much, and it wouldn't be fair on you because you wouldn't get, uh, you know, peace, and it'd be so much, pe so many people coming through and all this and that. So. It's nice to it's nice to keep us uh, <laughs> us out of the way, so we, we we don't cause any trouble anywhere else. <laughs> yeah, so they know where the troublemakers are. They're all in one area, locked away in the zoo. <laughs> but you can really see my cheeks. <laughs> one man and his whip it here. Hey, big fella. Hello. You all right? Yeah, good. You? Good. Enjoying the show. Oh, it's brilliant, isn't it? It's brilliant. We have got, oh, oh, we've got a troublemaker, we've got a troublemaker. <laughs> we've got, uh, we've got Portsmouth, Life Beyond Bricks, John and Tash, and we've got, we, we've got Mr. Sticker Man himself, the Sticker Man, Roman Rap, you wouldn't know the name of their channel by any chance, you wouldn't know. The van blends in, doesn't it? Oh yeah, you know, you wouldn't know, you wouldn't know, you wouldn't know, you wouldn't know. Little old me just got, you know, just blending in. What are you doing, Tash? You all right? What? What are you doing, Tash? I was coming over to have a pick a bone with you. What? Portsmouth, Portsmouth's here. Yeah, Portsmouth's here. See? Attitude. Give me attitude really. So that's the Portsmouth side. That's the Portsmouth side. If I'm not careful, she'll rip a door off in a minute. Hulk smash me. Hulk yeah, smash. So watch out. <laughs> See? Fred, you saw that. Fred, if I don't make it alive, this video don't get out. It's my last one. My last will and testament. Your face! Your face is just in my shot! <laughs> Um, a little roam around. It's Dom and Missy, we're the weirdos. They're uh, all parked up. Not far from where we are. It's Luke's, Luke's van life. Oh, <laughs> oh 
I haven't got far. <laughs> what are you supposed to be like? No, I'm trying to hide and do some videos. Oh, you're hiding. Oh, yeah, I'm not you're freaking on cognito, <laughs> am I? I kind of stick out a bit, don't I? It don't really work, does it? <laughs> but you're on the vlog right now. It's recording. Oh no! <laughs> Am I going to be on your video? Am I going to be there? <laughs> <laughs> em and Lou, Em and Lou are here in the camper vibe. Meg and Cal there, you've got to go look at their channel. I'll link their channel below, seriously. I might even put a clip now, I'll pinch a clip of their uh, videos. Honestly, it's like, like a BBC quality video. Them travelling all around Europe, the editing is immense. You've got to have a look at theirs and I've got all the, all the uh, YouTubers that have been here, I'll link them all, all down below, so you can go see them all. Ah, look, look, just the people I wanted to bump into. Just walk past <laughs> Just walk straight past them. Look who he is! Look who he is! What do you want? <laughs> what do you want? We've had this all day. It's the travel trolls! Hello! <laughs> you having a good time? Oh, it's brilliant. It is brilliant. Brilliant, honestly. He's at the shore, on the outskirts, He's not been more than 20 metres away from his van all weekend. <laughs> he's only come this far now because he's run out of beer and he needs to go get some more yeah. supplies. And chicken wings. I need, and more, I need, I need more chicken wings. <laughs> <laughs> it is great though, isn't it? Oh, yeah. It, it has been a good show. Amazing. So many people. Yeah. We're definitely coming to the next one. Yeah. I, I think they've got one in September. They have. Yeah. Meant to be, uh, I think they're going to be using the bigger, uh, another field, so it's going to be a bigger... Oh, wow. uh, well, that's another yeah. two-day event, end of September, I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. not sure. Going to be on that. But we'll try and get here early yeah. next time. Yeah, I'm going to be here early in that. We'll, uh, we'll probably see you all here, but if you haven't checked these guys out, then head on over to the channel. Thank you Travel Trolls. Thank you. TV. Thank Travel Trolls TV. There you go, TV. Travel Trolls TV. Just bought a little, uh, little resin leaf necklace for, for my mum. Um, uh, Rosie's resins, so I'll put a link. That's uh, Weirdo Weirdos, uh, Dom and Mrs. Uh, daughter Rosie. So she's got a little shop, so she sells her little bits of jewelry. She goes around and um, she goes around like when she's traveling, she'll find like a leaf and she'll press it, or she'll find a shell or a nice stone and all this and that. She puts them in resin and makes them into jewelry and earrings and necklaces and brooches. And yeah, just. Uh, Kid trying to make some money, so yeah, go uh, go check that out and go uh, go buy a few bits from uh, from an Etsy store. So I'll put that link in the description below. I'm gonna go back over here and chill out, get a Pepsi Max. Why not? Just chilling under the awning. People are still coming by, saying hello and all this and that. And look who's here! Hello guys! Hey! It's Little Man Adventures. Will. <laughs> it's food time. Yeah, baby. And. I haven't even had to go get it because <laughs> I've had uh, Harry from the Radfords, Roman Radfords. Roman he, Harry. Roman Harry. Uber has. Uber has. He does the delivery service. Cut the quid, goes and gets the food. Bang in. Look. <laughs> Philly cheesesteak. It's all starting to unwind now. <laughs> it's all starting. <laughs> <laughs> Dom and Missy, Dom and Missy are pointing their fingers at me and pulling faces. Look at them all. <laughs> Luke! Oh, <laughs> 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 I'll never let go, Jack! <laughs> Starting to uh, wind down now. Uh, people are going home and people are packing up. And honestly, God, it's been so good to get back out. The first meetup of 2021, and it has been a cool car. Banging, banging weather, as you can see. <laughs> um, so many people came out. We had such a good time. We met so many people. We had, had, had some great conversations, great laughs, great giggles, some good food, and just amazing company. So, this video isn't going to be major long, it isn't going to be super or anything like that. It's just a, you know, we've been here. This is the first one of 2021. We're getting back to normal. We can uh, 
we can go back to all these meetups. But yeah, so that is the Stratford meetup, guys.